The purpose of this video is to demonstrate adding in pictures and clip art from the Insert tab. Clicking on the Insert tab, we've got pictures and clip art right in here. I'll click on the clip art icon. It brings up the clip art task pane over here that allows me to search for an item over here. bringing up content. So I find an item that I want. I click and the item comes in over here. When the item is selected it has these selection handles around the outside. The corner handles you look for the double headed arrow and you can size it proportionally. The handles that are here on the sides are for sizing just that particular side. The green circle is for rotation. So I'll size this down and then putting my mouse pointer anywhere on the picture I've got a four-headed arrow. But as I try to move it you'll notice it's not moving. With the picture selected what you have to do is go to your format tab up here. Come over here to wrap text and set that picture to tight. And now it's movable. I'll bring in another picture. Clicking. And the picture is on its way. Again, sizing it down. With the picture selected, Format tab, Wrap Text, set it to Tight. Then I can put my mouse on the picture and I can position it somewhere. Once pictures are in there and selected, by the way, this Format tab will only show up when a picture is selected. It's a contextual tab. It's only open when something is selected. So if you don't see it up here, you need to click your picture and then it will show up. Some options then that you have. These are all frames that are available. I'll hover over various frames. You can see your different styles. There's a whole list of them right here of things you can put on. You can work on putting some artistic effects on your picture, changing the coloring, things like that. That's all available right here in the adjustments. You can pick a certain border, colored border to put on your picture with a color. You can give it a certain line weight, things like that, if you don't want to use a, one of the picture styles over here. If you want to put pictures together, I'll move this picture over here on top of this one. It's layered in such a way that it's behind this picture here. So I can tell it's still selected. I'll come up here and I'll click to bring forward and then that picture's in the front. Rotation is here. It can be handled by this green circle right here or the rotations if you want to flip it or go 90 degrees. And more rotation options right there for how you want to set that up. You can also crop pictures. So I'll select my picture, turn on the cropping feature. All I do then is I try that again move the cropping feature down, pressing enter, and then I've cropped it to the size that I want. Those are just a few of the features in putting in pictures.